people welcome to yet another interesting episode of pandora magazine and of course as usual i am your host agatha now tonight just like always i have a spectacular show lined up for you but before we get there take a sneak peek onto what's coming up and i'll be right back it's in english <laughs> This is a young boy. We have grown that one. Yeah. Now the battle of the DJs is on. Wondering which DJs in this country are the best or which upcoming DJs are the best? Well, various DJs in this country think they are better than one another. And there was no way to prove who is better than who than take it to the decks. Now what happened recently, there was a DJ's burnout at a mask lounge down in Bokoto and uh, basically DJs came together to battle it out and get to know who is better than who. Check it out. Battling it on this next that you are seeing tonight. It is so crowded in here. Everybody's on their top game. Everyone just cannot wait out for what is going to be happening. The DJs are ready. Everyone is feeling themselves from the various camps. We have DJ Sean and another DJ whom you are yet to find out. All going to be battling it out on this Sunday. So just keep it on the magazine. You're going to be seeing what is going to happen on this particular DJ battle. <laughs> We are for the DJ burnout that's organized by us Gong Records. Uh, we have a couple of DJs burning each other out. One of the DJs here who's gonna be witnessing the DJs battle, DJ Ma, DJ Ma Chachiri. Ah, Chachiri, what do you I'm having fun, waiting for DJ Burnout, as you can see, I'm having fun to pick up the Panama Magazine. Well, okay, all right, what do you expect from the DJ's matter tonight? I'm waiting to see what is happening next, but I don't know sure. I think all DJs are going to do good work, I think so. We've had something like uh, a long time ago, we always wanted to make sure the industry gets bigger and bigger for the DJs. Is it important in the music industry? I think that they get this industry to the ice cream. I think that, let's, let's wait to the next to see what is going next up. This won't be a gong thing, you know, every other DJ can come along for as long as he's good and uh, he understands what we need him to do and he's up to the task. So we'll be looking around for various DJs from other camps, you know, from other areas, independent DJs. As long as they are nice and they know what they're, they're supposed to be doing, then we'll have them on board. What? When are we going to see you there competing? I think for next time I have to pass it <laughs> yeah. uh, That was DJ Mark for you. Hello. Hello. What's your name? Hillary, DJ Hills. Yeah, what do you think about this DJ battle? This DJ battle, all the DJs, the two DJs are good. I'll take the best out of them. But you know who they are? How good do you think they are? I know DJ Charlie is one of the best DJs in Uganda. Well, DJ Shan? Charlie. So, How about Shan? Shan? Shan is also good. So I expect. Who do you think is going to win? I think Charlie will win again. Okay, let's watch, let's watch. It's not a battle, it's a burnout. Burnout is basically about entertainment. You can entertain crowds, but then you get to have two DJs burning each other out. Eh? So we have two DJs and two MCs. So we have a team of two, two. are out of the DJ Academy that we train and then circuit around the system. So we look out for the good guys that we know are good, that can give the crowd the best of the best. So pick the two guys and then have them on the battle set. DJ Shan, he is a good one who is in the camera, who is in the camera, who is in the camera, who is in the camera. Go, go, 
Gong, Gong is Rastafara. You see this? You see the Rasta colors? This is one la. This is Gong record. Right now it's not about giving a prize. It's about entertaining the crowd. You know, it's basically like sting. You know, each guy is going to sting the other as the crowd is enjoying that. Best mixes, best moments of skill, and all that. So the, Now we know Charlie's set is a final, okay? Now let's invite the next DJ on this set right here. Well, ladies and gentlemen, introducing DJ Sean. DJ Sean, get on stage! What? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is what we meant when we talk about the realest DJ in the mix, DJ Sean! We, we hope to take it all over the country, like have the best DJ in Soroti come and burn out a good DJ in Kla, have the best DJ in Kawa, they burn out a good DJ in Masindi, you understand? We have a national project, there are lots of good people, lots of talent out there, and then we can use those guys the other guy and so, so they can all share the same limelight because they're all stars at the end of the day. Teacher We have a million DJs in the country and uh, we have uh, lots of events to be doing for them. So what we do is one event to make sure we maintain standard, maintain quality 
and we ain't corrupt at all. So make sure it's legitimate. You understand? So that if a DJ is good, a DJ is good. So we make sure we receive to the good guys, have them perform, and make sure the standard is standard. Welcome to the land. You know the Rhyme Mouse. It's your boy Sun MC representing the Logo Flow Army. Representing end of the week with DJ Sean. You know we're the best of the top tables. DJ Sean, go up that bitch. Let's go. Ladies and gentlemen, you know I'm rocking with the best side of MC. Check it. The hat. Check it. Ladies and gentlemen, you're rocking with the best. Silver N O D J Sean Warwick. Hey ladies and gentlemen, you're still watching Pandora Magazine and guess what? We've had the opportunity or the chance to be on set for the new Tornado song of Radio and Weasel with around these artists. What's up with this video? The video is so cool. It's like it's done already, man. It's very cool. Like. Is this like the first star session? Yeah, no, we had the first session already, like at the beach. So this is the second one. Yeah. Okay. How? What is tornado about? Tornado. Yeah, we're just talking about life you, itself. You are a tornado. So many people are going to put you down. So many people are going to say so much stuff about you that is going to put you down. But you are a tornado because when the tornado down. moves, man, it destroys everything in its tracks, man. It leaves destruction and pain. So we are only going to leave destruction and pain for haters, man. Yes. Yeah. So. Last week, the Good Life crew went into some sort of scuffle with another artist named Palasso at a bar named Casablanca. Work hard! Party hard! All work is easy work! I think these guys were out there having a good time. Of course, each camp, the Good Life uh, radio and his friends, and then uh, Palasso with, of course, their new manager, Jeff, who is the former manager of the Good Life. And basically, things did not go down well between the two camps. And, of course, bros were exchanged. And uh, police had to intervene. Oh, uh, are you listen, he talked to me. Ten million. Listen, you guys, listen. Now, what happened is... Palasso claims uh, radio through the first blow and uh, radio as well claims Palasso is under through the first blow but what happens is we do not know the actual cause of this fight but many claim that either these guys were high or uh, god knows what 
or it's because of the musical differences that I are having. Also, the other people who are pissed off about what I do. Eh? It's so amazing that whatever we do, we put both our hands on the table. We don't do any tricks, and then somebody out there thinks it's a trick. There's a trick. Did you see the way you move that? There is a trick. There is. So it's very interesting that we even have such people. That is how amazing this music has really carried my life. You know, Jeff Chiwanuka. Jeff Chiwa, actually, the former manager of The Good Life, is now managing, of course, uh, Palasso, who is a new artist here in Uganda, and uh, AK-47 and Shiba, plus so many other artists. And what he wants is, uh, of course, to divide The Good Life crew, take uh, his bro the brother of uh, Palasso, that is Weasel, to his camp and basically leave radio alone to, you know, look for other means but uh, that's just a rumor we're not really sure but police intervened in this scaffo and uh, basically they are all sorting it out at police and uh, very soon we shall be knowing whether anyone is pressing charges against the other and they'll battle it out in court just in case charges are pressed There are rumors that the good life could split but still no one is sure about it because currently the good life escorted the up the ebony's down in chigali for their performance of course and they are still doing their thing together more gigs are coming in i mean recently they were nominated for the mtv um song with our money i mean one of the in the certain category with of course uh kenya's amani and uh, basically they are doing good so we are not sure if of course they want to separate or they're still doing their music and uh, let's just keep watching see what happens with a good life but for now things of the good life camp are not really looking good yeah Now in this particular segment of Fast Forward, definitely we give you a heads up on all the upcoming events that you should not miss out on. And one big one that you should watch out for next week is of course Desire's All Black and White launch. Well Desire has prepared a massive show for her fans and of course if you do not want to miss out on a piece of Desire, make your way to Serena Hotel on the 6th of June. And let's have fun! Cause this love is meant to be Yeah, yeah, baby Ooh. Still on Fast Forward Radio and Television Academy Awards are coming up and that is going to be on the 27th of June. Make sure you're down at Sheraton Gardens to experience which radio and television um, personalities and programs are awarded. Just be there 27th of June. Yeah. Recently, Richer Hand Uganda, together with various artists in this country, had a workshop at Kabira Country Club whereby they were starting on a project that is going to impact on young people in this country. Now, basically, what is going to happen is the artists in this country are going to get together with Richer Hand, uh, compose music, and uh, basically pass on the message that Richer Hand wants to pass on to the young people. Check out how the workshop went down at Kabira Country Club. I have I have the love for it. I, if I didn't love for it, I wouldn't do it because the fact is where there is a good cause, I respect it so much. So we just need to come together. This what they are doing, they are working hard to see that I mean they change everything that is not working today. But maybe tomorrow things will be okay. Now like we're fighting AIDS, so we have to come together, you know what I mean? Like me naturally I think sing about that shit that happens every day, you know. When I try to find a way to change your life, then I went on. We can walk and change yeah. the world. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs>
but we have space. We also have we also have space picking vernacular group there. Okay, if we are eliminating if we under multiple relationships, yeah, we could just say have one sexual partner. Yeah. Because, uh, look at the age the, 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 the mm. 12 year olds okay, yeah. at, have if necessary because you cannot advise a 12 year old to have a sexual partner. Abstain? Abstain. We could try, but it wouldn't be right. Yeah. yeah. Maybe 20 years, 20 years old plus. I've actually been and right now it's coming to one and a half years. Okay. One and a, I think it's one and a half years. But I've been working with other organizations too. And I, but I'm so passionate about Reach Our Hand because I like the tools that they use. It's young people for young people. We're tackling from a different angle, like we are using music. Music. You know, music is universal. So we are using music to like get the message across. And you know, we are doing a lot of things with Rahu, you know, camps and you know, teaching um, young kids how not to abuse drugs. So I'm thinking it's, it's pretty effective. The music will not solve the problems, but the music will teach people how to solve problems. The music will give people that the message exactly through. You can't solve someone's problem through music, but you can tell them a message through music. Like I believe that if through a song or a video or maybe a concert or um, something like that like you could they can talk to the youth well if you just give the youth a piece of paper a pamphlet or a brochure that says you know have safe sex um, or you know it's 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 a very blunt way of doing something but it's the message is not actually getting into the mind of the youth today is the songwriting we're coming up with concepts we're writing four songs that we're going to produce high budget um, music videos for and then the next stage will be going into the studio and, and recording these songs. So from all these artists, you know, like we have Big Trail, Irene Natale, we have Airport Taxi here, Ray Signature, Moise Hassa, um, there's Nyanda, there's Cindy who's also going to be involved with the project. A couple of them couldn't make it, but so the next stage is going to the studio and recording, um, which we're going to do throughout the month of June. And then in July, we're going to shoot all the music videos. Actually, a three-year project. We have one song already out. That's your ways. That the your ways song. That only had six artists. Yeah. So we are bringing in more artists like Cindy. We have uh, Jody from Rwanda yeah. and many other more. You know, more artists. So it's going to go till 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 next year. These things have been said, but why is there no change? Yeah. Why are people still getting pregnant at 13? Why are we still getting fresh HIV, you know, contractions? Why are we still... This is the message that has been there. You know, I've been getting it. Maybe we just need to be more practical, you know, to the people who are actually receiving these messages. Your ways, your ways. Yeah. Okay, okay. 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 like six. I'm, I'm in class. We wanted a local person to help us with that. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> but, that, we have, we have no album called but it's in English. It's in English. This is a young boy. We have grown that one. Yeah. For this particular episode of Pandora Magazine, people, I hope you have had an amazing time just as much as I have. And I hope that you still make it a point to catch me again next Sunday, 8 30, of course, same station. And our shout out to Go TV, our official sponsors of this show. And there are too many of you fans out there who make it a point to keep watching Pandora Magazine. Thank you for sending us messages on our Facebook page that is Pandora 10BS. Thanks for the love, thanks for the support, thanks for watching, and I hope you have a good night. Yeah.